I don't know if you guys have been familiar with this, but Nike and iPod finally linked up and have created probably one of the greatest tools that I like using. Um, this is my Nano Touch, the new one that just came out, so it has the slide, I'm sorry that way, the slidey touch screen, so on and so forth. But Nike and Apple have made this great little thing, which is the Nike Plus Run iPod thingy. And you're wondering, huh, what does this do? Well, actually, this is kind of like a sensor that helps you um, work out. So one of the things oops, that you have is on the Nike thing here, we have a fitness button. Press that. And then you go to the Nike Plus. I don't know if you guys can see this. And then you can either do your basic workouts between distance, time, or calories. You can set your goal. So once you do that, this little sensor here, when you start running or walking or whatever you're doing, actually picks that up. But people are probably like, where do you put this? Now this is where this gets a little expensive to use. You have to own a Nike Free Plus shoe. This is my Nike Free Plus, or my Nike Free Plus Run, I think. Nike Run Plus or whatever it's called. <laughs> What's the name? So what it is is that you take the sole out of the shoe like this. And if you can see in there, there's like this little divot right there that you can actually put this into. You pop it inside like so. I don't know if you guys can see that. You pop it inside like so. Then you take your sole put it back in there and then this actually has a receiver on it that allows you to record your time and also your distance. One of the things I really like about this is because you're able to put in your actual weight and height and all that so it actually gives you an accurate count of your calories which is kind of a great thing. Also um, there's little things that they have motivation workouts that you can find on iTunes so on and so forth so this has kind of been like one of those really really cool things that I found. Um, this is a little more expensive because of course you need an iPod or an iPhone or iPod Touch or so on and so forth to use that with. You need this system here which is about, I think this is about twenty something dollars, twenty or thirty dollars and the plus you need the shoes. So that can get a little bit expensive but if you're really into the gadget things that's one of the great things to use. But other than that um, it's really about staying motivated. Another thing that I've been doing is kind of writing down um, weekly goals. I actually, right over here, have a dry erase board, and each week I write a goal. So one of my three goals, I actually wrote three goals for this week, was one, to at least get in the gym three times a week this week. Two was definitely to control my portion sizes. And one, um, as I told you, within this new week of my diet, I was incorporating one grain and one fruit each day. But I wrote in parentheses to be mindful about the amount of carbs that I intake. So with that... Three times a week, been doing it very well. Portion size, one of the things that I've definitely done with that is using measuring cups. Measuring cups are great. Um, if you're a little iffy about different snacks and stuff, or even if you go pick up lunch or something, the best thing to do is actually at Target, they have these collapsible um, little measuring cups. So they're great to take with you if you need to go somewhere, or you just put something in a bag, you didn't measure it out, take the measuring cup with you, throw it in your lunch bag, bam, there you go. Um, definitely you want to control your portion size. And the last thing I said is incorporating one grain and one bread. But keep in mind that I'm taking good carbs rather than bad carbs. So those are a couple of things that I've been doing. Um, I'm probably going to break this little particular video down some to talk a little bit more about the diet and then maybe another video to talk a little bit more about the workout. But other than that, I really hope that you guys are interested in this video. If you have any comments or questions, just always leave them below. Any encouraging words to anybody that may be struggling with weight loss, definitely want to give them some words of encouragement. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you soon. Bye!